Ruben Wiki and his band of Ned Kelly lookalikes ready to bushwhack the Sea Eagles. Like a chieftain of old, Wiki has emerged as a living manifestation of the warrior ethos. Form aside, it's his influence on those around him that poses the greatest threat to Manly. He's just one of those guys that um, all the players love playing with. He's inspirational uh, and his form's actually sort of risen with the form of the team as well, so it's probably no coincidence. Cramming before tomorrow night's sudden death semi, Steve Price caught up on some study for his Masters of Business degree. His teammates looking remarkably relaxed. <laughs> The challenge we look forward to is just the excitement of still being in footy. Relaxed and focused, but it's control that looms as a decisive factor. Wade McKinnon returns from a three-week suspension for spitting at a referee. The firebrand fullback, the likely target for a manly bait. Wade's not stupid, so I'm sure he'll handle anything that comes his way. Across town, the Cronulla Sharks soaked up the good weather before tonight's semi against Melbourne. But beyond the horizon, a storm could be brewing. The suspension of Melbourne skipper Cameron Smith likely to create an emotional backlash. Retiring veteran Matt Geyer, a chance to take on the playmaking duties, a dummy half for the Premiers. Tui Pallor, Evan Charlton, World News Australia.